Hi everyone, welcome. My name is Scott White, Senior Lecturer at the School of Pharmacy IMU. Today we have Dr. Lee Choi Sin, the Head of Department of Pharmaceutical Chemistry, to share on the Pharmaceutical Chemistry Degree Program at IMU. Without further ado, let's welcome Dr. Lee. Hello everyone, I am um, Dr. Lee, the Head of Department for Pharmaceutical Chemistry. So today, let me um, share with you the overview of Pharmaceutical Chemistry Program in IMU. Let me share my screen. Okay, so okay, welcome again to the introductions of the Pharmaceutical Chemistry Program at IMU. So first of all, what do you know about the Pharmaceutical Chemistry? Pharmaceutical Chemistry is the study of drugs. It involves developing cures and remedies for diseases. It is an interdisciplinary study of pharmaceutical technology, chemistry, and also life sciences specialties. The study of pharmaceutical chemistry includes drug discovery, drug design, drug and chemical synthesis, formulations, pharmacology, pharmacokinetics, and pharmacodynamics, and also pharmaceutical analysis for drug safety and efficacy. The Bachelor of Science Honours in Pharmaceutical Chemistry degree is one of the undergraduate degree in IMU School of Pharmacy. It is a three-year program and we offer two intakes annually. We have two enrollment dates for both intakes. The enrollment dates for the first intake happen in the month of February and April and the enrollment dates for the second intake happen in the month of July and September every year. This program is accredited by the Malaysian Qualifications Agency, MQA, and also Royal Society of Chemistry. Royal Society of Chemistry, RSC, UK, it is the world's leading chemistry community and professional body, which advances excellence in the chemical sciences. The BSc Honours in Pharmaceutical Chemistry um, in IMU is also recognized by the Malaysian Institute of Chemistry, known as IKM, Institute Chemia, Malaysia. Graduates of this program, they are eligible to apply for IKM membership and practice as a registered chemist with the status of CHM in Malaysia. For those who are interested to gain overseas learning experience, we have developed partnership with Institute of Dundee, UK, offering credit transfer track to drug discovery related undergraduate and postgraduate programs. For the credit transfer track to University of Dundee, students will do one year foundation in science in IMU, one year in IMU pharmaceutical chemistry program, and two years in University of Dundee for the undergraduate degree. We're also in partnership with University of Sydney for credit assumptions for the pharmaceutical chemistry graduates who are interested to pursue the Master of Pharmacy in University of Sydney, Australia. So the credit assumptions resulted in reduced study load and also tuition fees deductions. Graduates with Master of Pharmacy from the University of Sydney, they are registrable for practice as a pharmacist in Australia, New Zealand and Singapore. Next, you could have asked, why study pharmaceutical chemistry at IMU? IMU is the first Malaysia's first and most established private medical and healthcare university with over 29 years of dedicated focus in healthcare education. We are celebrating 30th anniversary in 2022. IMU has achieved the Satara 2018 20. 2018 and 2019 tier six outstanding status under the matured universities category. In addition, we are the first Malaysian university offering the pharmaceutical chemistry undergraduate program. This program was first launched in 2008 and has gone from strength to strength to produce graduates and leaders who have built successful careers in pharmaceutical, nutraceutical, the supplement, personal care and other pharmaceutical and chemical related industries. Our pharmaceutical chemistry curriculum is benchmarking to international standards. The curriculum has been developed to meet high international standards as proven by the credit assumption offered by the University of Sydney in their two year Master of Pharmacy program or, and also the credit transfer track to University of Dundee. Also as mentioned, the program is accredited by the Royal Society of Chemistry, UK. A RSC accredited bachelor's degree 
it provides an access to professional categories and partially meets the academic requirements to become a chartered chemist. The award of the chartered chemist designation recognizes the practicing chemist who has demonstrated an in-depth knowledge, significant achievements, professionalism, and also technical expertise. AMU Pharmaceutical Chemistry Program prepares the students to get a head start to the job market by having a 16 weeks, a four month of real life work experience during the internship attachment in their final year of the study. The students, they gain an advantage to start developing their professional network during the internship. We have alumni being retained as permanent staff by the industry attachment company after completions of the placement. Besides, we also have some students took up the opportunity to carry out the internship placement abroad. So for instance, in the past, we have students, they carry out their internship in Singapore, Thailand, Brunei, India, Japan, France, and also UK. Most importantly, the IMU Pharmaceutical Chemistry Curriculum, adopting a comprehensive and integrated approaches to student learning experience. Apart from the usual lectures, workshops, oral and poster presentations, the program also offers a wide range of TNL teaching and learning methods, including we organize field trips or industrial visits. And we have one dedicated semester for the final year research project. We also um, guide our students to defend their research proposal at joint ethic committee meeting, problem-based learning. We have project-based practicals. We even have dramatizations in the curriculum. And also we have model industry concept MIC and also the basic training in CADD, computed aided drug design, and also the four months internship placement as mentioned. All these activities are strategically incorporated in the curriculum to equip our graduates with technical competencies, as well as to promote the soft skills development, such as through all these, um, uh, uh, through all these TNL activities, they build up their teamwork, effective communication skills, critical thinking, leadership, and lifelong learning, and as well as to, uh, to prepare the work-ready graduates with all the good mix of knowledge, hands-on skills, and transferable skills for their future career. Next is the career path for pharmaceutical chemistry graduates. After the three-year pharmaceutical chemistry program, the pharmaceutical chemistry graduates, they can work in diverse sectors, such as pharmaceutical and pharmaceutical-related industries, chemical-related industries, other industries, and also government agencies. For graduates who are interested to pursue postgraduate degree, MSc or PhD, they can pursue their postgraduate degrees locally or in overseas. We have alumni pursue their postgraduate degrees in IMU. Also, other, also they, uh, some of them, they pursue the postgraduate degrees in other local universities in Malaysia, as well as in overseas, such as Australia, US, UK, Sweden, and Denmark. Some graduates, they secure scholarships for their um, postgraduate studies. After completions of the postgraduate study, the graduate, they can either work in the industries or they can work as a lecturer in higher education institutions or work as a researcher in research institutions. Pharmaceutical chemistry students, they are competent to work in pharmaceutical, nutraceutical, cosmetics and personal care, as well as medical and dental devices industries. With the sufficient training in pharmaceutical sciences, medicinal and industrial chemistry, the graduates, they are also proficient to work in chemical related in industries, such as um, in the specialty chemicals industries, fragrances and flavors, forensic laboratories, polymers and materials, oil chemicals, consumer products manufacturing, and many other chemical related industries. Besides, our graduates can also work in food and beverages or biotechnology companies, such as the vaccine provider companies. So what are the work scope of a pharmaceutical chemist in the pharmaceutical, chemical, and other related industries? The pharmaceutical chemistry graduates, they can become the approved 
signatory in an accredited laboratory. As mentioned, the Army Pharmaceutical Chemistry degree is recognized by IKM. Graduates are eligible to apply for IKM membership and practice as a registered chemist with the status of CHM without sitting for the IKM LMIC examinations. Only registered chemists can become approved signatory and sign the certificate of analysis intended for the public. The pharmaceutical chemistry graduates, they can also work as research officer in R&D department. They can also work as quality control chemists to ensure drug or product safety. The pharmaceutical chemist can also work as a production chemist in the manufacturing department. They work collaboratively with chemical engineers and plant production personnel to scale up reactions or formulations. Many may not know the pharmaceutical chemist work scopes are not confined to lab-based career. They also have many important non-lab-based roles such as quality assurance executive involving in development and implementations of inspection activities to ensure the delivery of satisfactory pharmaceuticals or products to the market. Another important non-lab-based career is the regulatory affair. The regulator affair executive ensures new drugs or medical devices are safe and effective for use in the targeted patients' populations. Also, the pharmaceutical chemist can work as health and safety officer. They monitor the health and safety compliance in an organization. Clinical research associate is another non-lab-based um, career. So man, many, of, uh, many people, they think that the CRA is the researcher working in the lab for the clinical research. Actually, it is not. The clinical research associates that involve in administering and monitoring the clinical trials for new drugs or current drugs to assess the benefits and risks of the drugs. We have quite a number of graduates working as clinical research associates. They are employed by either a pharmaceutical company or a contract research organization. Last but not least, the pharmaceutical chemist can also work as a product specialist or technical marketers. So they combine the pharmaceutical sciences and chemistry knowledge with people's skills and business expertise to recommend the products um, and services that best match the customer needs. So now let us dis discuss about the frequently asked questions. I'll invite Dr. Chong to join me in this, uh, in this session. Dr. Chong. Thank you, Dr. Lee. Okay, so Dr. Chong, can you share with us what is the difference between a pharmacy, pharmaceutical chemistry, and also pharmaceutical sciences degree? All right, thank you very much. Um, a pharmacist focus on consultation, patient care, drug counseling. They often work in hospital and community setting. Uh, in addition to that, they also provide advice on healthy lifestyles. Whereas for pharmaceutical scientists, they typically focus on how medicines work, how safe and effective products are brought to the market, their impact on the body and their effect on the prevention and treatment of diseases. For pharmaceutical chemists, in addition to the pharmaceutical science subject, a pharmaceutical chemist will use their advanced knowledge of chemistry to assess the chemical and physical properties of both natural and synthetic materials. You want to understand them and to develop it into new medicines. To do so, they also use a range of chemistry techniques to design, develop, analyze, and evaluate new and better drugs for the healthcare industry. As they have a strong fundamental in chemistry, our graduates could work in pharmaceutical or chemistry related industries. Yes, I agree with you, Dr. Chong. And, and also the added advantage is that the pharmaceutical chemistry graduates, okay, they can also become the uh, registered uh, practicing chemist and to become a approved signatory. Okay. So also with the uh, knowledge and 
technical competencies in the pharmaceutical sciences formulations, they can actually uh, work in pharmaceutical or chemical related uh, industries. Okay, so for the second questions, Dr. Chong, could you share with us, do I mean pharmaceutical chemistry graduates that require provisional registrations and compulsory pupillage? All right, um, unlike the pharmacy program, the PharmCan graduates do not require provisional registration and compulsory uh, pupillage training. Nevertheless, to prepare them for the working environment, our graduates will undergo a compulsory internship program uh, for one whole semester. Upon graduation from the program, the graduate with one year of working experience will be able to register with ICAM to be a registered practicing chemist. This is also applicable to all IKM recognized chemistry programs or equivalent academic qualifications in chemistry. Okay, thank you, Dr. Chong. So I'll take the third questions. What is the demand of pharmaceutical chemists in Malaysia? I'm sure this is um, most of the students concern about the demand of the uh, uh, of a degree, okay, of a uh, professions. All right. So as you know, the pharmaceutical chemists we we contribute directly to the healthcare industry to ensure high quality of pharmaceuticals uh, continue to be developed, produced and improved. The healthcare sector in Malaysia has also been identified as one of the 12 national key economic areas. And hence, you can see the demand for the pharmaceutical chemists is expected to grow. And also the Malaysian pharmaceutical uh, industry is categorized into four categories. They are prescription medicines, over-the-counter products, OTC, traditional medicines, and health supplements. The local pharmaceutical companies in Malaysia, they are, they are mostly engaged in the productions of um, generic drugs, um, traditional medicines, herbal supplements, and also some of the injectables. Some local pharmaceutical companies, they also um, do contract manufacturing for foreign multinational corporation MNCs. In addition, there are numerous foreign-owned pharma companies having the manufacturing facility in Malaysia. Hence, you can see the opportunities and demand of a pharmaceutical chemist in the pharma industry. Not only that, there are also large MNCs who are licensed importers for imported drugs, the supplements, imported supplements, medical devices, and also vaccines. The PC graduates, they can work in regulatory affairs, quality department, business development, product specialists, and other important roles in these MNCs. In the current pandemic situations, the pharma industries and also pharma-related industries, they are classified as essential industries. So as mentioned earlier, the pharmaceutical chemistry graduates they have diverse roles, not only in pharma and pharma-related industries, they are also competent to venture into chemical-related food and biotechnology industries. The recognitions by the IKM enables the graduates to become the approved signatory of any accredited labs, um, including the uh, accredited lab in uh, government agencies, in pharma and pharma-related, chemical-related consumer products, food and biotechnology companies. The pharmaceutical chemistry graduates, they can also work um, in the professional organizations, NGOs, and also government agencies. We also have alumni who have become entrepreneurs um, because the degree has actually given them a foundations to create and improve new formulations. And some of them, they have ventured into personal care and cosmetic uh, business. All in all, the pharmaceutical chemistry is a versatile degree. It prepares the graduates to be able to venture into different specializations of or the fields of their interest. Okay, so let me do a summary. Pharmaceutical chemistry is a unique program with interdisciplinary combinations of pharmaceutical sciences, medicinal and industrial chemistry, and some life sciences disciplines. The students receive training in formulation science, chemical synthesis and analysis, drug discovery, drug design and development, biotechnology, chemical engineering and research to prepare them fit to work in diverse sectors of pharmaceutical, nutraceuticals, cosmetics, personal care, chemical related, food and biotechnology industries. If you're interested to know more, check out on our IMU website. Thank you.